Hello, my dear students. I welcome you all for SVK tutorials. In this video, I will be solving uh, the solutions for uh, model question paper two for the second semester BE degree examination. So, with the, for the computer science uh, stream, I have taken with the subject code B Mat S two zero one. So, first of all, I will be starting with the uh, common uh, module for uh, all the stream. So, which is uh, numerical method one. So, I will be taking uh, that numerical method one. In that, I may be solve all the problems, or uh, and uh, or or else I will be going with question wise. So for a time being, I am going with uh, question wise. So I have chosen question number eight A. In that question number eight A, you have the problem as what? Find the real root of the equation cos x equal to x cos x e power x, which is near to x equal to 0.5 by the Newton Raphson method. Correct to three decimal places. So let us uh, see the solution for this. So the solution is this is what uh, the question. So the consider the given problem as it is cos x equal to x e power x. We need to find the real root for this equation. So they have said uh, they have said that the near root uh, will be nearest to 0.5. So for that reason we have taken that as x not equal to 0.5. If they don't specify, we need to find nearest root to that. Equation. Okay, so then I will define f of x from that uh, given equation. F of x is nothing but cos x minus x e power x. Just I have shifted this term to left hand side. That becomes minus x e power x. Then so for Newton Raphson method, I need uh, yeah, I need f dash of x. So I am going to find out uh, the derivative of the given function f of x. So derivative of cos x is what minus sine x. Minus of x e power x we have. So for that reason, I will be applying product rule. X into derivative of e power x is e power x plus e power x into derivative of x is one. So e power x into one is e power x. This is what f dash of x by Newton Raphson method. So we have a standard formula that is x n plus one equal to x n minus f of x n divided by f dash of x n. I am going to find out uh, the approximate solution. Then by first approximation, I will put n equal to one. So x not equal to minus f of x not divided by f dash of x not. It becomes so. Then by substituting all the values, so I got. I am going to get x one equal to point five one eight. Similarly, x two will be equal to x one minus f of x one divided by f of f dash of x one. I got a x two as a point five one eight. So as I got both the approximation as same value, I am going to stop the iteration. So then I will define that the approximate root lie for the given problem is 0.518. This is uh, analytically have uh, proved, but now let us see how to solve by using your calculator. As we have a trigonometry function, the calculator should be in uh, radian mode, change to radian mode, and they have asked for fix for three decimal places. Fix the calculator for three decimal places. I have done all the thing now. Just I will start with x not value. The x not value is 0.5 plus equal to. Then I will start with directly uh, x1. I am going to find out x1 answer in place of x not. I am just substituting answer since uh, the value I have already uh, x not value uh, already I have entered. That's why I'm putting x not minus take a fraction f of x not. What is f of x? Cos x minus x e power x in place of x I have x not so put cos x not minus x not e power x not what is x not here answer so for that reason I will start with cos answer close the bracket minus answer e power for that press shift L N you are going to get e power answer so come to denominator part so we have minus sign answer Minus sign answer close the bracket minus open the bracket answer shift ln e power answer come outside the exponential term plus e power that is shift ln answer come outside and open the bracket close the bracket plus equal to it will get the answer as x one equal to point five one eight and if you press equal to again you are going to get same answer. So therefore, x two value is also 0 0.518. 
and x1 is also 0.518. Therefore, we can conclude that this is the way to solve the problems of Newton Raphson method. You can take any problem, it will be the same method. Find out x0 plus wherever we have x0, put uh, wherever you have x, put that as answer and solve the problem. So, I think you all understood. So, if you like this video, kindly do subscribe to my YouTube channel. I thank you all for watching this video. For Newton Raphson method, I need to get the uh, f dash of x. For that reason, I find the derivative of f of x, which is nothing but cos x derivatives minus sin x minus e power uh, now minus x e power x cos x derivatives cos x derivative is minus sin x minus x e power x is there. So derivative of this is where to find the differentiation of this is to find the differentiation of this we need to apply product rule that is x e power x plus cos e power x 